Marilyn Monroe, born Norma Jean Mortensen, June 1, 1926, August 4, 1962, was an American actress, model, and singer, famous for playing comedic blonde bombshell characters. She became one of the most popular sex symbols of the 1950s and early 1960s and was emblematic of the era's changing attitudes towards sexuality. She was a top-billed actress for only a decade, but her films grossed $200 million, equivalent to $2 billion in 2019. By the time of her death in 1962, more than half a century later, she continues to be a major popular culture icon. Monroe was born and raised in Los Angeles. She spent most of her childhood in foster homes in an orphanage and married at age 16. She was working in a factory as part of the war effort during World War II when she met a photographer from the first motion picture unit and began a successful pin-up modeling career. The work led to short-lived film contracts with 20th Century Fox and Columbia Pictures. After a series of minor film roles, she signed a new contract with Fox in late 1950. Over the next two years, she became a popular actress with roles in several comedies, including As Young As You Feel in Monkey Business, and in the dramas Clash by Night and Don't Bother to Knock. She faced a scandal when it was revealed that she had posed for nude photos before she became a star. But the story did not damage her career and instead resulted in increased interest in her films. By 1953, Monroe was one of the most marketable Hollywood stars. She had leading roles in the film Noir Niagara, which focused on her sex appeal, and the comedies Gentlemen Prefer Blondes and How to Marry a Millionaire, which established her star image as dumb blonde. The same year, her nude images were used as the centerfold and on the cover of the first issue of Playboy. She played a significant role in the creation and management of her public image throughout her career but she was disappointed when she was typecast and underpaid by the studio. She was briefly suspended in early 1954 for refusing a film project but returned to star in the seven-year itch. 1955, one of the biggest box office successes of her career, when the studio was still reluctant to change Monroe's contract, she founded her own film production company in 1954. She dedicated 1955 to building the company and began studying method acting at the Actors Studio. In late 1955, Fox awarded her a new contract, which gave her more control and a larger salary. Her subsequent roles included a critically acclaimed performance in Bus Stop, 1956, and her first independent production in The Prince and the Showgirl, 1957. She won a Golden Globe for Best Actress for her work in Some Like It Hot. 1959, a critical and commercial success. Her last completed film was the drama The Misfits. 1961, Monroe's troubled private life received much attention. She struggled with addiction, depression, and anxiety. Her marriages to retired baseball star Joe DiMaggio and to playwright Arthur Miller were highly publicized and both ended in divorce. On August 4, 1962, she died at age 36 from an overdose of barbiturates at her home in Los Angeles. Her death was ruled a probable suicide, although several conspiracy theories have been proposed in the decades following her death.